What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com doing Jaspie's five box Bowman baseball mixer number two random teams plus the early bird special. So we're going to start introducing this now, guys, where you do nothing normal, you do nothing different, but just buy a spot in this break. The first 15 customers that buy a spot in this break are entered into a randomizer for a free spot in this break. So the more spots you buy, the more entries you get as long as you're amongst the first 15 customers. So again, there is 30 spots, but only 29 sold. So here's the dice roller. Here are the list of customers that are all in this break from Tony all the way down to Kenny. So the first 15 go from Tony all the way down to Rex. Rex made the cut. So you 15 are Potter, a part of a free spot in this break. So we're gonna use the same dice roller for the free spot and the randomizer for the list of names and the teams in the break. So let's roll it. And wow, we got snake guys just two times. So customer at number one at the end of the randomizer will win a free spot in this break. So two top two spots. So one and two. All right, two times. After two times, David Duffy. There you go. Free spot in this break for you. And again, all he had to, all you had to do is be the first fifteen to grab a spot in this break. We'll be doing a lot more of these on our website starting uh, very soon, guys. So David, we're gonna add you to this list right here. We'll put a little like an arrow sign. That'll be a free spot that you want in this break. I see. And there you go. We're gonna use the same dice roller two times. From Tony all the way down to David, and that should make thirty. So we got one and two. All right, two times. Robert, all the way down to Scott. Sorry, I don't know why I put this here. Let's take that out. All righty, now let's go two times on the list of teams from the D-backs all the way down to the Nationals. No, Caleb, I'm here streaming the rest of the night, so whatever breaks tonight, if, if, if whatever fills tonight, it'll break, so... There's no time schedule, really. I'll be here all night. One and two. Two times. D-backs all the way down to the Yanks. All right, so Robert with the D-backs. Mark, you got the Reds. David with the Indians. Bradley with the Tigers. Matthew with the Marlins. You got Robert with the Astros. Joe Crow, you got the Orioles. Tony with the Phillies. Joe Crow with the Cubs as well as the Giants. David with the A's. Rex, you got the Pirates. Kenny, last ball, Mojo Padres. Rig with the Rays. Uh, David, you got the Rangers. Uh, David Duffy winning that free spot for being the first 15 customers grabbing a spot on the break. Royals. Thomas, you got the Twins. Allen with the Blue Jays. D-Mac, you got the Red, uh, Rockies. Scott, you got the Red, uh, Red Sox. Robert, you have the Washington Nationals. Uh, Willem, you got the Angels. Randy with the Mets. David with the Braves. TJ, you got the Chicago White Sox. Nancy, you got the uh, Cardinals. Scott with the Mariners. Tony Barker with the Dodgers. Uh, Hudy, you got the Brewers. And Scott with the Yankees. Now let's quickly alphabetize this. Let's name this sheet. And if you're watching on eBay, guys, uh, we'll go over just a couple minutes, but uh, the first two breaks are very, very quick breaks, so we'll, we'll make up the time, so no need to worry on the time. And then after this, guys, we're going to go to eBay really quick. Finish the two, uh, th couple eBay breaks we have on the website. And then we'll go back to the website. Who wants the Angels? Brewers make me trade offer. I do. Pirates for Cubs. Who has the Cubs? Joe Crow. I don't know if Joe Crow's actually watching. Also, guys, I, I didn't even specify the break, but it's a five boss Bowman mixer uh, that will include 2019 Bowman HGA Jumbo, Bowman Baseball Mega Box, 2018 Bowman Baseball HGA Jumbo, Bowman Draft Jumbo Box, and Bowman Chrome Baseball Hobby Box.
All right, guys. Well, just because we're kind of in a little bit of a short schedule, I know people want trades. I mean, is anybody going to make one? Pirates for Angels, Rex is saying now. Hugh wants the Angels. We'll brew crew for the Angels. Willem, do you want to trade the Angels for any of those two teams? If not, I'm going to close the trade window. Oh, well, actually, we don't. We don't. I don't. I don't think we do that here. I think if you're going to sell it, that's going to be on your end. And we will still ship you the cards and then you do whatever you want for them. Or give it to whoever you sold it to. But we don't really do that here. Alright guys, trade window closed. Maybe. Maybe you can. All right. Here's the list. There you go. Yeah, sorry about the confusion earlier, guys. It could be a little confusing, but as it says in the description, all you had to do is just be one of the first 15 to get a spot in the break, and then you automatically have a chance to win the free spot. All right, so here you go. Here are the five boxes. Uh, let me just quickly list them again just to make sure that these are the five that were left back there. So the 19 Bowman HTA, yes. Uh, so the 19 Bowman Mega Box, yes. 2018 HTA Bowman, yes. Bowman Draft, yes. Bowman Chrome Hobby, yes. There you go. All right, we'll just go actually some of the bigger boxes. Bowman Draft. Well, we can definitely let Nick know to make it less confusing, but I mean, I think uh, in the item description, it's, it's a little bit more clear, I guess, as it says, be, buy one of the first 15 spots in this break to get entered into a randomizer for a free bonus spot. The more spots you buy, the more entries you get, and then in quotes, as long as it's amongst the first 15 bot. So you're just being rewarded for buying the first, uh, being a part of the first 15, that's all it is. Which is uh, also definitely going to help, though, guys, because if you think about it, you know, stuff like that, that'll automatically, you know, who knows, depending on the break, the product that we're breaking, you know, um, you know, it could bring down a break pretty much halfway there, you know what I mean? You know, and then all of a sudden, it's, it's quicker to fill a break when it's at 15 rather than when it's at, you know, 25, 24. <laughs> you know so uh, it's a pretty cool concept and you know like I said as we're in this new store guys you know obviously Joe explained it a lot too as well since you see him more on camera than you would me but you know we're gonna do a lot of different things here on the website that we're starting to introduce like that early bird special you know obviously we're gonna start doing a lot more uh, giveaways prizes break credits you know where you have a chance to win some extra break credit, extra prizes, whatever it is. You know, if you fill up certain breaks on the website. Obviously, I don't know if Joe's talked about this, but in the very near future, we're going to be testing out scheduling breaks as well. Because I know one of the number one question is, when is this break going to fill? You know, when is this going to happen? What's the break schedule looking like? So that's kind of uh, in our... Uh, back of our heads that'll be coming up very soon once we get all the store situation fill, uh, you know, straightened out. And I think it's uh, definitely going to help out a lot. And it's just going to mean more breaks, right? I think uh, if, if we can guarantee a break to fill in the next five minutes, if it's scheduled, I, I, I think everybody would go towards that break first rather than just kind of picking and choosing what they want. All right, so this was, uh, I think, Bowman Draft, right? Good luck. Again, I'm not sure what ships and what doesn't, but in the item description, it'll let you guys know. Aramis Admin to 402.
So what did I get randomized for being one of the first 15? You had a chance to win a free spot. We did the randomizer. You did not come in at number one, unfortunately. So that's pretty much all it is. So you would have got an extra spot for free after the randomizer. Not numbered, it looks like. Chris to 499. And I believe Joe actually has done a couple of these early bird specials too, right? It's not like I'm the first one to do it. This is actually number two, so I'm assuming we did another one of these before. We got an autograph, Bowman's first, Josh Stowers. That is Seattle Mariners. Mariners, Scott, there you go. Mark, yes, I did, buddy. Uh, it should be also uploaded to our YouTube channel already. Uh, definitely uh, worth watching over and over again. <laughs> uh, Rex, you're about to be muted for a couple minutes. You'll be on timeout. <laughs> I don't know what I've been doing these whole last four or five years. Chris to 299. Or to 250, sorry. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I, I, I hope you do too, Mark. Uh, what do you mean, TJ? What, what do you mean was uncalled for? A Rex's joke? <laughs> now you guys are just going crazy. Christopher, what's going on, man? All right, we'll be doing that after this, Christopher. We'll be a little delayed a couple minutes, but we'll, we'll finish that up after this. To 50. Bruce Dar. Ryan Mountcastle. It's 150. Oh, I was speaking to Rex when he's talked about that. Can you explain the tire braking concept? I have no clue what braking is. So I was just replying back to him like, yeah, you don't know what you've been doing for the last five years? I think you and Rex have been here pretty much the longest. I think Rex actually has been here before I've even been here, actually. Before when Nick was braking like with no camera. All righty, Anthony Siegler, Bowman's first for the Yankees. Yankees, Scott. Is this an autograph? Oh, this is a facsimile, right? I, I think I actually came like right after that a little bit. No, actually that was like in the summer actually. So that's not true actually. So yeah, you were in the stone ages, right? Before people thought of breaking cameras on their faces.
autograph, Nick Madrigal to 99. White Sox. TJ with that one. Which was a joke, right? <laughs> Is it really Rex? I have no idea. K. Brian Hayes to two fifty. Is it really a good hit? I have no idea. I'm not I'm not into these baseball prospects. I know these players that much. There you go, man. There he is again, but just a regular Bowman Sterling. After this, Grego. I'm a little behind already, but after this. But there you go. Um, I mean, yeah, I don't know. Should I penny sleeve everything, Steve? I actually don't know. Um, I mean, usually when it's like usually this Bowman draft stuff, I know we just kind of go by the paper base and then, um, you know, any numbered autographs, we just penny sleeve. But I'm separating the chrome and the, and the, um, and the paper base. So, I mean, if I'm passing some stuff, let me know. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I mean, I got it separated, though, but... Yeah, I don't know. TJ, I, I'm, I don't have anything towards any of you guys, to be honest. I just think the chat also kind of goes into it with each other sometimes, but I don't... I don't have anything against you, man, for real, though. I don't have anything against anybody. I actually don't know, Grego, because um, I know once we're here now and we get Upper Deck approved, I still don't really know. I still don't really know if what we're going to do with hockey. I don't know if we're going to keep it on the website, but try to sell it differently. But um, I think for now, yeah, I'm just going to break on the main channel the days off of uh, the days that Joe doesn't to keep us seven days a week for sure. And then on the off days, I don't know if I'm going to combine eBay with let's say hockey again or you know some other other venture i know somebody just brought up where's happened to the 10 buck breaks but i don't know if that's something we're going to be doing in the future again either but i just know that more opportunities here now that we have this store so but i'm definitely be breaking for sure the day that joe isn't just to keep us seven days a week but other than that i don't really know what else is in store yet we kind of haven't gotten to that point but I'm sure uh, once we kind of get it figured out, we'll let all of you guys know. But I know that's like now that the website kind of moves a lot more on the days that Joe doesn't stream, just because people are starting to realize we're ten days of seven days a week. Um, you know, it, we'll do obviously like lesser eBay breaks just to keep it, just to keep it more website oriented. But I think it's also kind of a plus though, just doing some eBay on the days I stream just because it kind of introduces the eBay customers into uh, our main channel website breaks, you know, so that way they can kind of, you know, shop the same day, you know, they don't have to really switch a channel in a way. We stream on both. I know somebody brought up that. <laughs> somebody brought that up yesterday, 24 hours in karaoke. I brought up, we you know it'd be really cool is to raise money for like a charity and do like a breakathon, 24 hours. Wouldn't that be fun? Bowman birthdays.
Ronald Acuna and Colton Welker. That is number to 250. Uh, like legit about a mile, Steve. It's really not that far. Uh, the border of where we were at, Redondo Beach, um, is uh, was really kind of Hermosa borderline as well. So we're really not that far. But we're in a much more populated location area-wise just because we're on PCH. You know, Pacific Coast Highway right there. So, and we're right on Pier Avenue. So, the Hermosa Beach Pier is just kind of maybe a, you know, one fourth of a mile down. Um, so that kind of attracts a lot of customers to hopefully come our way as well. Keybert Ruiz. Los Angeles Dodgers, that's going to go to Tony Barkey. Sandy Alcantara, 250 for the Marlins. Oh, sorry about that, Hugh. I forgot you're kind of like me. Evan White to 125 for the Seattle Mariners. Scott. Abert or Adbert for the Cubs, Joe Crow. And we're so close to the sidewalk here, guys. You know, the studios that you hear anybody that's walking by. Is that a good one, too? I just, I wish I was into baseball just as much. Like, I know Joe's preferred sports, obviously. It's kind of like mine, but only just one, right? Football and baseball. I think baseball is more of a baseball fan than football Joe is. But for me, it's just a little different. It's just football and then hockey. So I do more of, like, watching more hockey than I do baseball. And plus, I think I kind of got in a way. Into, I kind of got in a way from baseball just because, you know, and to be honest, this is kind of the reason why. Is that I have direct TV. I don't have Time Warner Cable, so... I don't even get to watch any Dodger games, really. And obviously now streaming in afternoon nights, I don't really get to watch as much sports as I used to. But since the Dodgers went to Time Warner Cable, I mean, I wasn't going to switch just because of that. Like, DirecTV is a little bit better. So, don't really get to watch too many Dodger games. Nick Gordon for the Twins. But, um, yeah, I mean, definitely got to get into more baseball at least. I mean, I know the names, the bigger names, just not prospect-wise. You guys will definitely know way more than I do. Yeah, well, definitely Rex should know who that is. I know he's a big Cubs fan. I think he's on the rise, supposedly. Kevin Newman to 499. I know it's funny how that goes. All right, one more big jumbo box, and then we just got two regular hobbies and one, actually one hobby, one um, mega box. So after this, guys, we're going to go to eBay, and don't worry, eBay, I'll catch up, guys. Those Donner's football breaks are pretty, pretty quick. We'll make up all that time.
So again, if you're watching on eBay, these are breaks that we have on our personal website, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Definitely check it out. Pretty much all sports on our website right now. Pre-orders for new releases this week. Um, so on Sundays and Mondays, I do stream on both channels uh, to make us seven days a week. And then on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, for now, just streams on eBay. So on Sundays, Mondays, there could be little delays here and there on either website breaks or on eBay breaks. But for the most part, you know, it's never too crazy of a delay. I think it's funny though, guys, to be honest, that's how, that's kind of how it goes though. Like <laughs> we're over here, like, where's all my hits at? Where's all my hits at? And it, it may not work for some of us, but I feel like for a lot of us, especially as a group breaker seeing it, I don't know. It's kind of like that Joe Pizzo effect. You know, a little, a little complaining sometimes helps for some reason, you know? So watch now, all of you guys complain about no hits, and then I'm gonna have to. I'm probably not gonna hit every everybody a hit, but some of you guys, and I'll be like, "What? It didn't work." All right. So it's 2019 Bowman Jumbo. Yadier Molina, 250 paper. <laughs> exactly. See, there you go. Well, we still have three boxes though, guys. So don't don't give up too quickly. Especially in a break like this one. This one has a couple of jumbos, so this one will have three autographs. And there you go, there's some pirates. Mason Martin. Bowman's first. It's Rex. Marlins to two ninety nine. Matthew with that one. Joey Bart. That's a. I don't know what that is, but I'll kind of see if you guys have heard of this guy before. Oh, I think no paper based is shipping, right? Everything else is, I believe. But yes, it'd be a little different, but I also think it'd be a lot more pricier just because of how much base there is. Shipping, shipping is crazy, guys. I'm sure that's how a lot of breakers do it as well, besides eBay. To some people, they love the paper, some people don't. Everybody has their different preferences of paper. It's like a short print or something, but really not. All right, should be what? Two more autographs on this side? If not, at least one. I don't remember how many autographs we pulled on the first side. Giants to two fifty. Joe Crow. Bowman's first. Purple. Whoa. As if. It's literally what I heard right now from the window. Oh, 
Oh, I thought these were numbers. Oh, there is number four ninety nine. Padres. Went to a car store yesterday, bought two packs of SB Authentic for Future Watch. Christopher and Otto. Nice. For the Phillies, Matt of uh, Yearling to four ninety nine. Phillies, Tony Barkey. Last little stack right here to to 150 Colton Walker for the Rockies alrighty so that's the bubble mega box Bowman ex Bega Box exclusive cards coming up. Casey Mize, Tatis Jr., Rookie of the Year favorites, Luis Arias, Vlad Guerrero Jr., Purple. At least it looks purple. Yeah, number to 250, the show. That's Cincinnati Reds. Mark Matheson. There you go. All right, last box, everybody. Good luck. So the Nathan Bowman Chrome. Let's try to pull. At least one of these guys on the box. One autograph per mini box with some parallel numbered serial cards. Good luck. Would be very nice, man. I mean, I hope something nice, nice and a big, nice one in here. You know what I mean? Bigger rookie, because I mean, this rookie class is pretty loaded. Obviously, if it's an Otani autograph, it should be a redemption. So, anytime I see a redemption, I always think of that. But I forget. I think there's this Yankees pitcher that's always in here that I always think it's an Otani, and then it's like a Yankees pitcher. I forget his name. Lo Ciega, I think it was. I did a lot of this Bowman Chrome. Last year, so kind of got used to some of these. All 
Uh, no, Mark. I don't... I I mean, maybe other places have done that, but we don't really have majority of rules. I know in our last website it had the rules, but maybe I'll see if we can try to put that on our website. But yeah, no majority rules here. If you have a team in the... If you have a team on that card, you automatically have a shot. Obviously, the odds will be in your favor, but yeah, I don't think we've ever done that since I've actually been hired here, so... Um, and then when I started breaking as well, that was kind of the rule that they told me as well. But, I mean, regardless, though, I mean, some pretty nice stuff you got out of there. So, congratulations. But, Arenado to four ninety nine. Trammell to four ninety nine. And Luis Medina to two fifty. Yankees. Oh no, thank you, man. Huh. I mean you did the work really. I just opened the boxes. You sold it out. Buschetti to six fifty five. Alright, last little stack right here, one more autograph at least. To two fifty or one fifty, another one for the Toronto Blue Jays, Allen. And Dustin May. Dodgers. Tony Barkey with that one. There you go, guys. Well, unfortunately, I know there's going to be a lot of players, a lot of teams that got, went hitless. It's a very hit or miss type of break, especially with only five boxes. But very nice stuff. I mean, some of these prospects, I wish I knew a little bit more about them. I could have got more excited, like with other sports or teams that I know of. But again, uh, here were all your numbered serial number cards, uh, autographs, of course. There you go. And no randomizers to do here as well. I heard this this guy's killing it in the minors. So there you go. White Sox with that one to 99. And yeah, here you go. Appreciate it, guys. Coming up next is some eBay. And then once I get done with eBay, uh, anything else on the website that has sold out, we will do next. Appreciate it, guys.